it's already up. It's an electronic billboard. It's on a rotation. It's catching drivers who are on their, presumably, on their way to work for their early morning commute. Um, we are on Telegraph just south of I-96 across from Detroit Diesel for anyone who ends up in the area. But uh, basically, Livonia police, they're pushing back on social media saying that they are not guilty of racial profiling. Livonia has a reputation for race-based traffic stops. Um, so, you know, kind of determining whether or not someone looks suspicious based on the color of their skin. So supporters of the Black Lives Matter movement raised money to put up this billboard at the city border. It reads, quote, driving while black, racial profiling just ahead. Welcome to Livonia. In my experience, I've seen more black people pulled over in Livonia than white people when there are so many more white people than black people here. Sarah Overwater and Delisha Upshaw say a lack of cooperation from Livonia city leaders sparked their billboard campaign. They say they asked for statistics measuring numbers of black people pulled over by police. They say complaints indicate a disproportionate number of African-American drivers are stopped, considering the community is predominantly white. This billboard campaign is part of a push for accountability. They've been aware of all the work that we've been doing to try to get information, try to get data, try to get um, you know, that transparency so that we can help build trust with um, the police department and the community. Um, and this was kind of, you know, a, a number 11 step in that unsuccessful process. We'll hopefully bring attention to the problem that people of color in the area know exists. In response, Livonia police posted a denial on their Facebook page, saying there's no sort of racial profiling happening. Part of their statement reads, quote, racial profiling is a serious allegation and is not tolerated. Livonia is a welcoming community to all, regardless of one's race. This billboard sends the exact opposite message of our values in the Livonia Police Department and of those in our community, end quote. Now they've posted to social media, but 7 Action News did reach out to Livonia Police for an interview. However, we have not heard back. The billboard is supposed to be up for the next two weeks. Live in Redford this morning, Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News.